found these uh, LED uh, tripod work lights at Costco for $40, or at least they're on sale right now for $40. Uh, it's ending soon, so if anyone's looking to pick up a set, now would be a good time. Um, my goal or plan with these is to utilize them for um, camp lights. Uh, I've done a couple things uh, with them to make them a little bit uh, at least better for my use. Uh, first things first, they come nice carrying bag here and it uses a USB-C charging. The base of the tripod locks in place. You push this button and it releases it and it doesn't lock in place, it just comes out and it has two adjustable heights here. It's not the tallest tripod light. Um, they flip open like so and they do a 360 flips on these things so you can aim them whichever way you want. Power button right here and it has um, three different levels of brightness and different uh, two color uh, temperatures. Um, it's got the warm white and the cool white. See, they're pretty bright. And they also uh, spin off the base here. It's a quarter 20. And the bottom of this has uh, mag three magnets and a hook. So you can stick them wherever, or you can hook it and use them on a tree or something. All right, instead of dealing with the spin-off uh, tripod, uh, spinning it off the tripod, and honestly, I don't know how often I'll be taking it off the tripod, but it uses a quarter 20 uh, threaded uh, stud there, and it threads into the light. I bought, I found these. They're typically uh, used for camera equipment for like a quick disconnect. As you can see, it just it fits in any direction or any of those four corners and it just snaps in place. So taking it on and off, it's a lot quicker using this mount instead. Um, found these on Amazon. They're not too expensive, uh, but compared to the light, they were about half the price of these lightings. Uh, they were 20 bucks versus uh, $40 for the lights. Um, so obviously with the uh, disconnect like this, I'll lose the ability to use the magnets or the hook so what I did was 3d print um, an adapter I guess this allows me to thread or bolt a couple of these around the truck or wherever I may want to use these and I can just go up to it and snap them in and that allowed me to still use the light without the tripod in any of the areas around my truck magnetic feature I bought these uh, um, rubber coated magnets and it's bolted to one of these and this will allow me to to uh, stick these wherever I want super strong it just snaps in like so Way they're designed they don't fully uh, secure it but it's just based off of weight and the way it's hooked on there it just has the little nub right there on one side and it just connects and it just snaps right in like so and this allows me as long as I keep the, uh, the letter upright this will hold it in place and I can use it you can see here is I didn't like that they only came in a white and a cool white mainly for bugs I'm hoping this uh, amber film uh, it's actually just tape will allow me to uh, minimize the bugs at camp and this still works with the brightness and you can change it from the cool white to the warm white and it changes the intensity of the amber 
to test it here and see. We got a couple bunch of bugs out right now. So we'll put the two together and see if it makes a difference. All right, this is with all the lights around my house turned off and I'm gonna see how the bugs do between the two if one attracts them more than the other. See a couple, couple bugs flying around the white. Now if we head over to the amber one, still see bugs flying around. And after swapping locations, it seems like the bugs are still attracted to the amber. So it doesn't seem like the film is going to work for bugs, but it will help with how bright it is at camp, I guess. As far as color wise, it's definitely the amber is easier on the eyes, but you can see there's tons of bugs flying around here. Here's one that's bolted onto my truck. This will allow me to mount a light on the side of the truck if I needed uh, some extra lighting. $40 for a LED uh, camp light um, is worth it. Um, they're plenty bright. Don't really need a lot of light around camp, um, but they're small, portable, and uh, don't take up much space. So I have to do a updated review video on this on the trails, hoping to have some some feedback on the trails or on the campsites but I haven't had a chance to get out.